Hi, I'm Dr. Chua. I'm a dental surgeon in Small Bay. I have been working in Small Bay for 10 years. Hi, question one. What is tooth extractions? Tooth extractions is removal of the tooth from its sockets in the jawbone. Extractions can be divided into simple and surgical extractions. Question 2 In what conditions surgical tooth extractions is needed? Surgical extractions is needed when a tooth cannot be easily accessed or removed through simple extractions. For example, the tooth that is broken under the gum or the tooth have not been fully erupted such as impacted wisdom tooth. Question 3 What are the reasons for tooth extractions? A very common reason is that the tooth is unrestorable and usually associated with toothache. It can be due to tooth decay, periodontal disease which is gum problems, or dental trauma. Sometimes, impacted wisdom tooth that cause repeated infections will need surgical removal as well. Lastly, in preparations for orthodontic treatment, which is braces treatments, commonly tooth extractions is required to create the space for the crowded teeth to be moved into. So move on to the next one. What is the recovery time for tooth extractions? It may differ due to the type of extractions and also positions of the tooth. The initial healing periods will take about 7 to 10 days for the new bone and gums to grow into the gap. So the next questions will be what are the possible complications of tooth extractions? Possible complications for tooth extraction including bleeding, bruising, inflammations, infections and also dry socket. The most common complications would be dry socket. After tooth extractions, blood clot will form naturally into the sockets. In some situations, the blood clot may be dislodged prematurely and it may lead to dry sockets. Moving on, what is the aftercare for tooth extractions? First, bite the gauze for half an hour. Do not rinse and spit after tooth extractions. For mild discomfort, take the painkiller that is given to you. After extractions, avoid hard food at the moment. Take some soft food which can be easily chewed and swallowed, which suggests that you do not smoke for 3 to 5 days as this may lead to dry sockets. The last question. What do you do with the space after tooth extractions? There are many options to replace a missing teeth after tooth extractions. The most popular options will be dental implant, which is the next best thing to healthy natural teeth. It consists of an artificial tooth root on which a dental crown is anchored. Implants tend to be secure and stable. Another option is a dental bridge, which made of crowns on the either side of the missing teeth supporting a false tooth and is cemented in place. Another alternative to that would be a denture. A denture is a removable false tooth which is made of plastic base or chrome base. It claps on natural teeth and can be easily inserted and removed. Because neglecting to replace the missing teeth will cause bone loss which cause the cheek and the lips to look sunken in, instantly aging you. Not only that, when you leave a gap after tooth extractions, the teeth beside will be start shifting. This will cause crooked teeth and trouble in eating. So remember, good oral health is important for your overall health. I hope that I have answered all your questions about tooth extractions. Okay, so I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.